hey guys i am i am back with another video uh welcome back to my channel we all get into it is basically on how to get a better body how to get a better physique um i i see a lot of pictures on instagram i see a lot of pictures online about bodies or people you know taking pictures of their bodies but they don't really show you how to do it they show you the workouts but they don't really show you on what to focus on first and like how to go about these workouts in the gym and everything like that. So first off, to in order to build your physique, uh, I'm gonna do this in order, in order to build your physique or to have a really, really nice body. First things first is cardio. Um, I'm gonna tell y'all my order, but yeah, cardio is first just because you do not want to build a body that is full of fat or is too fat you know what i mean like you don't want to build a body and it's not chiseled because i feel like you're just working hard and you're just being lazy on the cardio department to get that weight off you you know what i mean you can build muscle when you already have fat you can turn that fat pretty much into muscle like you can trim it down and everything like that but it's just a lot more work and then your muscles become a lot more bulky and then you look like a michelin man you know what i mean like you really don't want that look I don't want that look for you. Your clothes aren't going to fit that right. You know what I'm saying? It's not going to be a good look for everybody. You know what I'm saying? Because, you know, it's just not a good feeling. You know what I'm saying? You also want to be healthy. And I feel like a lot of people skip cardio. They go straight into weightlifting. They go straight into sports. They go through everything. But nobody wants to do cardio. And that's what I'm saying that you have to get on the treadmill. You have to run because you want your physique to be less than 10%. You know what I'm saying? Like anything higher, it's okay. It works, but you're not going to be in the top 1%. Like if it's less than 10%, that's when you start getting those results. That's when you start getting, that's when you could be an influencer. You know what I'm saying? If, you, if you're trying to do social media or whatever like that, you want to be less than 10% because it's it's more difficult, you guys. Like it's harder to get, it's harder to attain. And y'all know things that are harder to attain, people want. But you have to put in the work in to get that. So I would just say the first things first Get on the gym, lose the weight, please, man. Like, I, I I understand my football guys, they're big, they're huge, you know what I'm saying? But we don't want, we've seen enough linebackers, you know what I'm saying? Especially in the black community, I'm going to be real with y'all. We've seen enough linebacker bodies, you feel me? Like, it, we need something different. We need more quarterbacks, you know what I'm saying? We need that type of physique more, I feel like, in the community. So, it could be appreciated. But it's just like, for our community, you know what I'm saying, black community, right? like, like that, it's just too bulky, you know what I'm saying? It's just too bulky but yeah first cardio get on treadmill run walk around the block you know what i'm saying lose the weight don't be too try to aim for less than 10 percent, please if you can't do it i understand but i'm just saying if you can do it take advantage of that start with that second the next thing i would say is one of the most important features on a male body for you guys to understand is shoulders you have to have nice shoulders. Everyone's talking about arms. Everyone's talking about abs. Everyone's talking about glutes. Everyone's talking about thighs. Listen, as a masculine figure or as a man, shoulders are what define masculinity for us. Shoulders for us is basically antlers for a buck. You know what I'm saying? Antlers basically show where the man is, not the man, basically antlers show where the animal is in his life, basically how masculine the man is, and being able to defend, everything like that. Shoulders are important. So second, please work on your shoulders. You do not want to walk around. You don't want to have shoulders like this. It might be too close. I don't know if I can show y'all, but basically, yeah, you don't want to be rounded. You know what I'm saying? You don't want shoulders like that, man. Like, you want to make sure you are hitting your shoulders. If you have weak shoulders, you need to emphasize your shoulders because that's what's going to get you in the shirts. That's what's going to give you that triangle. You know what I'm saying? From shoulder to waist ratio. You know what I'm saying? So cardio first, then shoulders because you want to be like that. You want that V taper. You know what I'm saying? Like, real, by that ab region, the Adonis belt is important for a reason because it shows a V taper and it shows that you are healthy guys please hear me please understand this shoulders do not sleep on shoulders you know what i'm saying do not sleep on shoulders definitely work on that next thing on having a nice nice body is working out a lot i don't know what is the big deal i don't know why people are so confused about this um 
But in order to work out, you have to be healthy, right? But you have to work out. You have to go to the gym. If you want a nice body, you have to go to the gym. Sadly to say, when you get older, your metabolism slows down. You can't eat like crap. Like, you can't do it. It just, you know, everybody has their moment whenever metabolism is really, really quick and everything like that. But when you get older, people are in the gym not because they like it, but because they have to do it to lose the weight. Unless they want to do surgery, you know what I'm saying? Let's say they want to spin that bread and, you know what I'm saying, alter their bodies and everything like that. Like, that's a whole nother video. But make sure you are going to the gym. It's nothing wrong with going to the gym every day. You are men. Men, we can fight. We can go to the gym. We can we can do that. We may not have the time. I understand that. Families, jobs, everything like that. So sometimes you do want to relax. But at least try to get into the gym like one day a week. You know what I'm saying? Start with that. And then try every day. See how you feel. You might like an everyday type gym. You might like a five days a week, two days off. You know what I'm saying? But just figure out, you know what I'm saying? Just get your ass in the gym. Like, you know what I'm saying? Go to the gym, try it out, see if you like it before you tell me you don't want to do it or before you tell me you can't do it. If you want a nice, especially if you want a nice body, always no excuses. If you, if you want a nice physique, oh, the treadmill or walking is not a debate. You know what I'm saying? You may have uh these perfect genetics and everything like that but like think about it not everybody's like that even if they are like that sometimes they do a lot to maintain it you know what i'm saying it's a lot of things that you probably aren't seeing to maintain that shape we don't know what they're doing but i'm just saying if you even have good, good genetics take care of it you feel me like keep up with it do not take it for granted like oh i just have these amazing genetics like if you have good genetics you have a good body be thankful you have a fast metabolism, that's more reasons as why you should take care of that because that is not common. <laughs> dieting. Dieting is last. Dieting is last. Dieting is last because as a man, you can work off your calories. You know what I'm saying? Just as you can like work and pay for meals, you can pay for things that you want. The same with the gym. If eating costs, you feel me? Eating nice costs, eating seafood, eating all these foods, eating fast food, it costs. And how you pay that off, you go to the gym. But dieting will make your life easier. You know what I'm saying? Meal prep and dieting, figuring out what works for your body type. I will have videos coming out with that. Especially if you want a nice body. Especially if you want to be chiseled. Especially if you want to uh, stand out. Don't eat like crap. You know what I'm saying? Like if I'm not, you know what I'm saying? I'm not a vegan. I'm not telling everybody just stop eating, you know, uh, animals and everything. I'm not saying all that. I'm just saying like, you know what I'm saying? Try to clean it up. Kind of. Try to diet. You feel me? Like I, I put that kind of at the end just because dieting is not easy. I understand that, but start with something. Start somewhere. Do not just not diet just cause, cause it's not smart. You know what I'm saying? You end up working even harder uh, to lose weight, especially if you want a nice body. And then uh, last tip, I would say is just buy nice clothes. You know what I'm saying? If you are uh, on a heavier side or if you are trying to lose weight, you know what I'm saying? You don't have to go with the tightest stuff. You can you can get bigger stuff and then slim down. You know what I'm saying? It's kind of like, okay, boom, 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 slim down. But start. You know what I'm saying? Start. Uh, definitely use me as an example. That's my take on it. That's what I suggest for you guys to do if you want a nice body. If you like the video, make sure you like the video. I will have more videos like this. Thank you so much for watching and get in the gym, please. And listen to this video and like the video. But I'm out. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you on my next video.